Hello everybody, this is TechnoLionX and you are watching the video review of the new Swift Key 4.3. The version which we are going to show you is a beta version. Up till now, Swift Key has been one of the best keyboards available on the Play Store. The beta version contains some bugs but they might be fixed um, in the new feature and we get the stable version. Let's start. This is the layout of Swifty 4.3. I hope if you can see it, this is the same as the previous versions. There's no change in the layout, but uh, some tweaks added to it. The best and the most uh, prominent feature added to uh, Swifty 4.3 is this feature. So you can see after uh, holding on this button, I get the small settings box. So I can access to settings, themes, all these uh, additional features provided by 4.3 on the go. Let's start. These are some of the features which, we were, which were available on the previous versions. This is um, the SwiftKey Cloud. You can upload all your uh, dictionary or personal dictionary on the cloud. You can access it anywhere. These are the languages. There's a long list of languages available to download across countries, different different languages. This is a uh, uh, section for uh, theme and a the layout. So uh, these are the different themes available. You can also enable the arrow keys if you like them. You can also set the vibration of the keyboard. You can also choose flow or voice tapping or voice, or, uh, voice explanation, voice typing. Let's see what's been added to um, Swiftkey 4.3. Here you can see these are some of the features which we haven't seen uh, previously. This is how you can split the keyboard by just choosing it from here. It's very easy to type and you can also enable flow on it. Very responsive. You can also choose a compact view of the keyboard. This is usually helpful for um, um, uh, big phones or tablets like the Galaxy Note 3 or even uh, big big tablets like the Nexus 7 or Nexus 7 II. There's another feature given by you can resize the app previously. Uh, it was not available on the screen. You had to go uh, to the settings panel and then choose uh, but here you can access it on the go. You can see different lengths of the keyboard. You have five different sizes available. And the most prominent feature is this. You can detach the keyboard from uh, the dock and you can um, shift anywhere on the screen. 